Welcome to Good Mythical More. We are sampling lots of energy drinks. What is this one? What is this one? Brain? Rain. Rain. Brain. It says it right there. Rain. And we got we got some Celsius. Is that it? And Arizona tea we're gonna be trying today. We got so many. We also have a freeze frame. <laughs> Not gonna work for me. See, my hand keeps going in front of my face. <laughs> I can't freeze it. Try me. to freeze it. Try that. <laughs> I bet you, can't, bet you can't freeze it, but the software won't work. So if we move these back, how do you want to, you want to do one of these type things? So chug is like the, is like the same as get F. Get it over with is how I feel. Well, the, get it how, over that, with. That's how you think about things, isn't it? <laughs> well, when you chug a drink. Chug is. I know, but it's a, I don't understand. It's just, a, it's just about the physical connection, man. But if you don't so, want anything long term, it's just about it's about quick one and done, man. So what it, what do I need to taste in order to do that? Because if I want to drink, well, we don't some, have to get into those details. If I don't like it, I'm going to chug it. But if I really don't like it, I'm going to spill it. And if I really like it, I'm going to sip. If it. If you love it, but you feel like you don't want to keep loving it a lot, you chug it. If you sip it, you want to savor it for a lifetime, and if you spill it, that means you don't want it at all, bro. Uh, I thought it was pretty simple to understand. But, alas, you're saying you want to no, get it over No, that's not insulting with. at all. <laughs> you're saying that chug means you don't like it, and spill means you don't like it. Well, you uh, know what, that probably makes sense. You're probably gonna not like two out of three of these, so you know, if that's, that's your system, that's fine. But we've got to. We, yeah, we have it, to somehow. I think it's going to be okay. Somehow buddy. agree. <laughs> I think it's going to be fine. Okay. I'm not going. Yeah, I just don't understand how how can there be so many energy drinks on the market and a new one every month? I don't. How does that happen? People need energy, man. They need energy. Uh, are we are we having a, a, a caffeine epidemic? You want to drink straight from the yeah? Can? This is brain. Storm, brainstorm, rain, rainstorm, <laughs> clean energy, zero sugar, mango. Ten calories. This is brain, storm, brainstorm, rainstorm. I think that people I like just like. One. I mean, what I okay. was told is that ever since we had the Celsius on this show, that the Celsius has become a popular choice here in the office. And that a bunch of y'all are Does doing this correlate? caffeination. I don't think that correlates. You think it was? You think it was pre? -show? I think it was happenstance. Happenstance. There are no coincidences. Mm -hmm. Rainstorm strawberry, apricot. I kind of like this one. I it, guess what I'm saying is it's that tolerable. Like, in the afternoon, you like to get a coffee. Yes. But some people are like, I don't want a coffee in the afternoon. I want. A, Energy drink, or there's just people who don't like coffee, but they need caffeine. I mean, caffeine. It's, it's true. I get it. I'll get an iced coffee. So, and then the energy drinks have all this other stuff in it. But stuff that you need, like high fructose corn. No, no, never any high fructose corn syrup. Artificial sweeteners, stuff that is going to here you go accelerate your metabolism. Try strawberry apricot. Not bad. They have the same aftertaste. Well, it's it's the artificial sweetener. I actually, it's still so candy. It's like I, I feel like, like a I feel like a child athlete. So far, when I drink these. I I'm chugging mango because I like it, but I don't want to keep coming back to it. It feels a little bit like a guilty pleasure. It's it's so sweet. This, I, you feel like it's sweeter than, here, move, go ahead and move it out. We'll just use the cans. I feel like I could sip on some, uh, whatever one. Strawberry apricot. It's a little milder. They all right. hit so yeah, hard. Yeah, 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 it's mild. Oh gosh, guava strawberry. Guava. I mean, what's the latest in the day that you'll have caffeine? On a weekday, uh, 4.30. But you, it's like, if you go out to eat, let's say you go on a date, and you want to after, you wouldn't do an after dinner coffee, or you would. 
You would or you wouldn't, and why? I if um if it's if it's a Friday or Saturday night. Weeknight. Oh, a weeknight? No, I wouldn't do that. But I didn't think it actually kept you up. I don't think it will, but I don't want to risk it. Oh, there's like Your yeah. caffeine cut off to bedtime is is technically too it's too close. Me? Cuz yeah, cuz don't you go to bed at like 9? Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, nine. Let's say nine. I don't know. He metabolizes caffeine more quickly, or whatever. The it doesn't affect him. Yeah, because you're supposed to have like an eight hour gap. That's how Christy is. If I Certainly. have caffeine after two o'clock, I will have trouble going to sleep. And sometimes I'll be sitting there and I'll be like, "Why am I thinking so much right now?" I'll be like, "Oh, you had caffeine at some point." Yeah, I've never noticed that. I don't like this one though. I do not like it. It's just. The thing I don't like about it's the these worst is, one. I don't like Agreed. candy. So I don't like to drink something that's making me feel like I'm drinking candy, even if it's 10 calories. I, I just don't like candy that much. Not a candy man. Uh, I agree with this arrangement here. So we're, we are in... Um, if you want a long-term relationship with rain Str Strawberry apricot. Strawberry apricot, yep. if you want to just get it done, get it over with, but in a good way. <laughs> Mango. Mango. We are in total agreement, see? We were bickering for nothing. But good gosh, what is Arizona tea doing here? They're so big. And Arizona is owned by Amazon? It says Arizona Prime right there. It's got oh, the Prime, oh, that says oh. the Prime logo. They bought it? What? Oh, oh, it's a Fallout branded okay. drink. Okay, I get it. It's a it's a co it's a co branded issued thing. by Vault Tech Agricultural Department, which is like part of the thing. See, this is for children, y'all. It's for it's getting kids hooked on caffeine. No, adults can like art. I like art. I'm a big fan of pretty things. Crack that one open him. You don't like pretty cans? I don't know, it's like... Um, well, this has got natural caffeine and polyphenols. This is green tea, red apple. It's huge, it's huge. 180 calories per can. So this isn't artificial, it's real sugar. You'll like that, right? It'll probably taste better. Good God. 45 grams of sugar. It still tastes a lot like tea. <coughs> tastes a lot like tea. Because it is tea. That's what makes it much better in my mind than the energy drinks. Because it still tastes like Arizona tea. I like it, I, I prefer this over an energy drink, certainly. But I don't love tea. There were people who would do this in high school. People would have these big, not the cans, they would have a big plastic plastic pitcher of Arizona tea. Y'all remember this, those? They so would have it at their apple. house. And I would be like, your parents are getting that for you, huh? I would judge them. I judge people. Apple tea. You can tell a lot about a family from their fridge. They have, they made tea bags? What do you mean? No, it was no, a, no, it was a pre-made large jug. That you bought the whole, I've never seen All Arizona yes. tea. And what I noticed about these families is that they also had Sunny D. So if they had Arizona tea, they usually had Sunny D. In the other hand? A lot of times the mom would double fist it, yeah. Come on, kids. Good, yeah, she'd come good. out, everybody's drinking out of the hose. She's like, don't drink out of the hose. Pomegranate. I've got Sunny D and Arizona tea. Energy drink. So it's, okay. I'm trying to see how much. 234 milligrams of caffeine Good per God, can. I need to slow down. <laughs> I need to slow down. And you know, you know when you open this thing, even though it says two servings, that you're drinking all 22 ounces. Yeah, once you start, man. I quite like the red apple. It's subtle. Um, let's try the, let's try this. Uh, I judge the Sunny D houses as well, I'm sorry. <laughs> Take that I would also back. judge people who had chocolate milk. 
I had that. Why? No, 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 no. You didn't have chocolate milk. You made chocolate milk. That's right. I was, I was, I was my only manufacturer. If there was house. a family that had a jug of chocolate milk, I would be like, "That's wasteful. That's they, they're, they're, these people got too much money." Because we would make it. You know what I'm saying? You yeah. gotta make your chocolate milk. You can't just buy it Syrup, pre-made. powders. You don't have to get it pre-made. Yeah. I mean, you like, can make it yourself. You got chocolate milk in the fridge. You're living and high you can Omaha. Ma- you can make it just as the right amount of chocolatey you want it. This one doesn't taste like tea. This is more subtle than the last. Pomegranate, that's why. Pomegranate is one of the most subtle flavors. In the I don't fruit think family. it's as subtle as the apple. Well, apple's also a subtle flavor. The apple's really growing on me. I might. I could. If you, if you I'm, ever, I'm literally sipping the apple. I'm if just you saying. take a big handful of pomegranate seeds and you bite them all at once, you will agree with me. There's not a lot of flavor there. It's great, but there's not a lot of flavor. It's always it's, subtle. It's the texture that I love. I'm I'm proposing that we switch these two because the it the pomegranate is. We haven't had the last one yet. It's got a um a cherry flavor. That I don't love. Well, then you so you don't want to switch it because again, chugging means you like it. <sighs> Sipping means you don't like it. Yeah, that's true. But I'm if I had to put it in one of these, like I want, I'm sipping this because I want to savor every second. Chugging is you like it so much you have to get it over with. That's just how you eat things that you like. That's well, but I'm tracking it to the original game. Back to our back to our point of contention at the I beginning know of this. What you're doing? F. Mary kill. So when you want to F something, does that mean you want to get it over with? Is that what you're saying? <laughs> I'm just looking for clarity here. It's just one. It's not an active part of my life. It's not something I'm gonna sit there and take forever. The rest of my life. Fing? <laughs> I'm just trying to I'm just trying to understand. You mean the T. Okay. The T. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. This is the best one. This is the best one. I don't like the the pomegranate. Here's the thing. I don't like the pomegranate. Okay, then this pomegranate. Spill it. We spill it, we don't want it at all. Spill it, we don't like it. But which one, which one can you imagine drinking for a week and which one do you just wanna just go for it and get it over with? (laughs) Down it. The apple. Hold on. I want to spend. I got to figure out which one of these teas I'm going to have sex with. <laughs> give, me, give me a second, man. <laughs> I do like the apple, but <laughs> well, Georgia peach. I like that. I don't know, man. Peach tea is something that. There's a lot more of that out there than apple tea because it works. So you're saying peach tea you sip? Yeah, just apple long-term tea. relationship. Just like every day I'm gonna get up and I'm just gonna- Settle I'm, down with a Georgia peach. I'm gonna appreciate another little aspect of it. Yep. There we go, we did it. All right, so we have one more. Now we're to the Celsius. Well, why are people choosing Celsius here at the office? Is it because of the flavor? Is it because it offers something else? Is it, is it, does it feel like it's marketed towards creative professionals? And how do you guys go about doing that? Is there a, uh, is there like two or three of you get gather together and be like, let's go see Carly. And like you walk up to Carly together and you all say it in unison and then she's like, I guess I gotta do it. Like, how does it work? How do, you, how, how do we get to the things that are in the fridge? What's the process? Of everyone back here, only one person drinks it. It's Sierra, so we might be the wrong sampling group. Sierra, did you go with the group to request it? No, but I was excited when it showed up. Oh, it just just happened? Yeah. Randall told me he saw it on Costco, he ordered it, and then by lunchtime they were all cleared out of the fridge, and he's like, the people have spoken. The people speak in that way. Okay, there it is. I'll admit, I asked for Diet Dr. Pepper to be on this side. Because it was on the other side. 
I don't like to have to, I don't like to walk to get my diet done. <laughs> All right, so we have Astro Vibe. We've already been through what these are on another more. This Cosmic is all the same, same color. It's and all Gatorade color. Galaxy vibe. So I'm so not pl I'm not pleased with that at all. So start with the Astro vibe. I want to be different colors. Seems way less exciting. Yeah, I also don't like the top of the can. I don't drink. You don't drink this one? Ooh. That's not good. That's not good. Whoa. That's not good. Now we're back to like red. That's red an energy nasty. drink. That's yeah. an energy drink that I don't like. Yeah. Spill it. Spill it. Well, it burns body fat, Link. See, but do you buy into this crap? It gives me essential energy. Ten you can calories. hate chug it. Hate chug it. <laughs> I, see, um, I see what you're working with. I'm trying to see. Contains 200 milligrams of caffeine. 200? This is a thousand percent of the biotin that you need. Why would you need? I don't need. Why do I need so much biotin? Thousand. Like, why would they put a thousand percent? I don't know, man. Of biotin. Um. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Ten calories. I'm gonna for now. I mean, should I find an energy drink that I like instead of just drinking coffee in the afternoon because it has all this other crap in it that is supposed no. to help me? Coffee's good for you. But it's got other stuff in it that makes me suspicious. Coffee's got good stuff in it as well. All right, so. It's got the polyphenols. So let's go with um, Cosmic. This has got cherries in it. I can see them right there. This one's much better. Much better. Oh. Huh. That is quite nice. How much biotin does it have in it? Thousand percent? Thousand percent of what yes! you need. I'm getting 10 days worth of biotin. <laughs> biotin. All right, let's get to this last one. We're gonna, I don't care where you put it right now, we can move them around, but we know it's better than this one, right? Yeah, that, yeah, that one's better. That one was horrible. Galaxy vibe, or like a Miami Vice This one on doesn't it. have a fruit on it, so it's up for guesses. It's the most Effervescent. <coughs> what is that, a melon? What is that? It's I, okay. It, it, it gets bad, though. It starts good. But if you chugged it, Sierra, you might what's not... your favorite one? The strawberry lemonade. Oh, this is sparkling strawberry watermelon. It's the, the vibes aren't the best one. Oh, you don't like the vibes? Too strong. Yeah. Too strong, too much caffeine, you gotta watch out. Um, it's pretty candy-ish, yep. I'll chug it. We're in agreement. I'm gonna settle down. Cosmic, cosmic. vibe. Mm -hmm. There you have it. Of course, next here time, I am chugging it. Next time you're getting ready to, to stream your <laughs> games. See, that's what us old guys think. You know what to do. Gamers drink energy drinks and that's it. They get, they gotta be on their toes, man. I they mean, gotta be sitting there are, being entertaining in real time for hours. Are the Olympic athletes on the sidelines drinking this stuff? Huh? Probably not. Before they do their flips and 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 chunk and and, and chucks and, and and spins. My favorite event this year is the chunks. chunks. They chuck stuff. <laughs> you know, beach sledding and yeah. all the crap that they do. Ain't nobody on the sidelines drinking this stuff. No. Don't miss your chance to grab July's Pin of the Month, available today only at mythical.com.